Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com and today we're going to show you how to jailbreak your iPhone running on iOS 6.1.1. Okay, first thing you need to do is make sure that your iPhone is on the latest firmware, which is at the time of writing this, 6.1.1. It should show it right here in iTunes whenever you plug into iTunes. Uh, if you have the latest ver version of iTunes and you can't find your iPhone in here, when it's plugged in, simply go to View and then go to Show Sidebar and that'll show this up here. Then you can click on iPhone and see the information here. Now, if it says anything other than 6.1.1, um, anything beneath it, click Check for Update. Uh, and wait for the iPhone to update to 6.1.1 before you continue. In addition to your iPhone needing to be on the latest firmware, your iTunes needs to also be the latest version. Um, at the type of time we're writing this, it is needs to be at least 11.0.1. Okay, after everything is up to date, we're going to close iTunes uh, and leave your device plugged in. And then we're gonna download the correct evasion program for your operating system. So whether you're using Mac, Windows, or Linux, either way, you're gonna click on this link here to be taken to the developer site. And then select which version of the operating system you have. Uh, if you have Windows, it's a .zip file. The other ones are pretty self-explanatory. So I have Mac that we're using, I'm gonna click on that. And then click there to download my attachment and wait for it to download. Okay, once you've downloaded the program, uh, you're just gonna double click it. I saved it to my desktop just so it was easier to find. You might wanna do the same. Uh, and then now if you're using Windows, essentially instead of double clicking it, you're going to right click it and hit extract all because it is a zip file. Either way, it will open a folder with the evasion program inside. On Windows, right click it and hit run as administrator. Um, for the other operating systems, just click it open saying that it is supported and it detects your phone again make sure your phone is plugged in at this point and hit jailbreak and then wait for it to do its thing at some point during the process uh, it will actually stop and start flashing a message to you uh, to tell you to unlock your device and tap the new jailbreak icon make sure to only tap it once uh, so make sure that you do that and wait for it to continue. And that's it, it'll tell you jailbreak complete. Uh, the device may restart a couple of times and, and you're all set, couldn't be easier. So if this procedure helped you at all, please uh, click on the support us link uh, at the bottom of the program and donate to the guys or at least visit their site and thank them. Um, they do work pretty hard at this and it's kind of amazing that they're able to do this. Other than that, if you would like to unjailbreak your device, uh, we have a link at the bottom of this procedure to show you how to get everything back to stock. Enjoy.